Konnichiwa, I'm Jasmine Makes and today I'm going to be showing you how to make this cute Zuzu Pets hamster. Mine is Carly, which is why she's pink and orange, but you can make any hamster you want using this design. And these are little legs or wheels and I think she's so cute and I hope you enjoy making her. So. Let's get started. So today you'll need one hook, one loom, about 10 um, white bands. I'm actually using glow in the dark white bands. That's why they look kind of greenish. You also need two blacks, approximately 30 of the color of the body of your Zuzu pet. I'm making Carly, so I'm using like a mixture of orange and pink. You'll also need one little pink, it can be light pink but I've run out of light pink for the nose and you can use a C clip if you want. So first, take your body coloured bands, these ones, and then make a starburst on these pins here. If you're using lots of different colours like I am, it's good to make them alternating. Like so. And take one band, wrap it around your fingers three times, and put it here on this pin. Alternatively, you could just wrap it around this pin three times. Now take your hook, and go inside the cat band and grab the first band there that's underneath it and hook it here go back inside grab the next one and hook it onto itself and again grab the next one hook it onto itself grab the next band it onto itself, grab the next band, hook it onto itself, so grab the last band and hook it onto itself like so. So now we're done with the first row, it should look like this. Now to make legs, take one single white band, wrap it around your hook twice and grab it, wrap it back over itself, so there's four loops here, then take one of your body coloured bands Wrap it around your fingers twice, put it inside your hook like so, and push the white bands onto it, and put this back on your hook like so. Take another body coloured band, put it inside your hook, and push the foot on like so. So you have to make four more of these if you're going to include the ears, because the ears are made exactly the same way. So now you ha should have all four legs plus two ears, they all look exactly the same. So now we need to make the next row. So take one of your legs and put it from this pin here to this pin here, like so. And take another one of your body bands, put it here to here, and then add your next leg from this pin to this pin. Put on the rest of your body band like normal. And take your hook and hook over the bottom two bands on every pin from the outside. So go out, zoom in. So go outside your pin. Grab the two bottom bands and hook them over the top.
like so. Push your bands down. Now add on your next layer. Now for your next layer, take one of the legs and put it from this pin to this pin. Then add a normal band. Then add a normal band, add the next leg. on your neck, your ear, from this pin to this pin, one of your ears, add a normal body colour and then add your last ear from this pin to this pin. And now just hook over the bottom two bands on all the pins like normal. You put the nose, take one of your blacks, wrap it around your hook four times, and the same with your other black, like so. And then take one of your body colour bands, put it inside your hook, push these band, this wrapped band onto it, and then do the same with another one. Like so. Now take this band and put it from this pin to this pin. And then take normal body colour, put it from here to here. And then on the next one, put your other eye. And then continue it with just normal body colour bands. Like so. Now hook over the uh, the bottom two. So when you just have this on your loom, take one of your whites, put it from this pin to this pin and then twist it back over this pin, like so, and put it from this pin to this pin. There will be a lot of tension so be careful. Take the next one of your whites, just put it on normally, and then take your next white, just put it from this pin to this pin. And then take it, 
stretch it out and twist it back over the pin so you have two layers on the pin and then put it on that pin and then put your last white and like normal now hook over the bottom two again on each pin Now just stick your hook inside each pin, grab the bands and pull them off the loom and keep them on your hook very carefully because there is some tension. And then pull it off your loom, like so. Push out all the legs because they will be kind of stuck inside of your hamster. So pull them out. And the ears and the eyes. Like so. Now, take your last band, the light pink one for the nose, put it inside of your hook and push all of the white bands onto it very carefully. Make sure none of them break and make sure they all go on. Put both ends of your pink on your hook and then take one end and push it over this end. So you just have one end on your hook, pull it like so. So it's a slope knot. Now go inside your hamster in any place nearby, grab the pink band and pull it through so it disappears inside of your hamster. And there you have your cute little Zuzu pet. I hope you like him or her. Mine's Carly so I guess it's a girl. But I hope you like her and I hope you enjoyed making her and I'll see you in my I'll see you in my next video. See you later.